the latest in a string of bizarre deaths that have daunted the church's Clearwater operations over the last two decades. The highest profile example, of course, the 1995... The uh, whole idea of in session consists of just those two things. It's not the PC sitting in chair, it's not the PC with you with an EMI running the platform, anything like that. There are no good and battles or conditions. It's just willing to talk to the auditor and interested in your own case. Just those two things. Now these withholds violate the willing to talk to the auditor and a person never goes into session. He's always out here around the perimeter of the session. He's never in session. Might even get slightly interested in his own case, but he's not in session. And you just plain can bother a PC that isn't in session. Oh, you've got to put him in session before you can audit him. So the first and foremost condition of getting a gain on a PC is to get off his window. Because he won't get in session until he's in the case for the audit. Looks like we got some company. Oh shit, I've seen her before. Take a good look at this face. What are you guys doing out here? You know this girl? I'm here doing what she can't do anymore because she's dead. You know who killed her? Why don't you go back in there? I bet you can find out a good whoa, idea. Whoa, whoa, Hang on, man. Hang on, hang on. Come on, come on. Come out here. Chill out for a second. He's, he's cool. Sit down. Let me tell you something. Just listen to me for a moment. I want to tell you a little story.
So 75 million years ago, Prince Xenu had a problem with overpopulation. He took his alien subjects, he froze them, put them on DC-8 rocket-powered airplanes. Drop them into the volcanoes of Hawaii. And then he dropped hydrogen bombs on top of them. Well, they all burnt up, but their souls escaped. <laughs> okay, and these souls, they're called body thetans. They go to soul brainwashing centers where they watch movies and then they infest your body. That's OT3. When L. Ron Hubbard discovered it, he called it the wall of fire. He would be walking through the wall of fire. I just saved you a lot of money. I've told you everything you need to know about it. Excuse me. Excuse me. What's going on here? Diane, what are you doing out here? You need to go on back inside. Well, sir, you know anything about Amy? Yes, you know, you about, know her. Go on inside. Tragically, you actually need to go right inside. What are you guys doing here? Just yeah, what, what are you money. doing? Now, what are you doing here? We're here no, because we're defending people that can't defend themselves. Come on, now, what are you doing here? What are you doing? I'm doing here, here because I'm standing no, up for what I believe. Here? Why are you here? We're here because we believe that you guys are messed up, that you're taking people's money and okay. you're lying. But, yeah, I understand, but why? Really, why are you here? here so that they get the real information before they walk in there oh, okay. and get all okay. your bullshit. Well, you need to take the signs out of here. You need to get out of here now, okay? We don't have to go guys anywhere. This is public property. The police are on their way. This is public Get the fuck out of here! Right now, just get the fuck out of here! Get the fuck out of here! Now! You I call the cops and they're coming! Leave. You have a bullet! I'll fuck you, asshole! Just get the I'll fuck out of here! I'm gonna kick your ass! Get out of here! Ah, oh, shut up. You don't know what you're talking about. Scientology is really tolerant! Sorry you had to see that. I was out ethics. That is not okay. I apologize. But I still need to see you in five minutes in the session room for your sec check. Okay. Are you on the moon? No. Are all cats black? No. Am I an ostrich? No. Are you holding up a tree? No. Am I an elephant? No. Is this a security check? Yes. Have you ever forged a signature check or document? Yes. Have you ever blackmailed anybody? No. Have you ever cheated? Yes. Do you have a secret you're afraid I'll find out? No. Have you ever practiced cannibalism? No. Have you ever committed bigamy? No. Have you ever practiced homosexuality? No. Have you ever had intercourse with a member of your family? No. Have you ever been sexually unfaithful? Yes. Have you ever practiced sex with animals? No. Have you ever consistently made a practice of sex with a member of your own sex? No. Have you ever slept with a member of a race of another color? No. Have you ever had anything to do with pornography? No. Have you ever committed arson? No. Have you ever been a newspaper reporter? No. Are you hiding anything? No. Have you ever had intercourse after placing another under alcohol or drugs? Have you ever had intercourse after placing another under alcohol or drugs? No. Have you ever injured Dianetics or Scientology? No. Have you ever committed any overts on a Scientology organization? No. Have you wronged any?